So we are updating GBP Dominator software inspired by all the amazing before and after grids which I see on Facebook. All of our customers posting amazing results, before and after results in conjunction with this new amazing API by OpenAI. So we've combined the two, OpenAI's latest API to GBP Dominator. And then I saw a mate of mine, Harlan, on Facebook showing another another preview of the update in Notebook LM. So I thought, so in other words, what does Google think about GBP Dominator? So it's easy, I threw it in Notebook LM. And then I came up with another way to produce video content for the audio interview Notebook LM producers. Last time I used Fiverr and that was awesome. This time is much faster, much less expensive and literally 10 minutes of my time to produce this. And after this video, I'll take you through step by step exactly how I created it. All right, everybody, buckle up because today we are going deep on local SEO. Ooh, local SEO. You know how you find that perfect pizza place near you. Yeah. We're diving into Google Business Profiles. That three-pack everyone wants at the top of the search. And this software, okay. GBDP Dominator, it claims we can get you right in there. Dominating that three-pack, that is the holy grail, right? For local businesses. Yeah. If you are not in one of those top three spots, they're like invisible. Yeah, it's make or break. Yeah. And this GBP Dominator, that's what caught my eye. They're not just saying like, oh, you can get one spot. Right. They're saying you could be in multiple spots across your entire area. In the entire area. Yeah. So, like, imagine you're searching for, I don't know, a plumber. Yeah. And the same business is popping up for every neighborhood nearby. It's everywhere. Yeah, that's the kind of visibility they're promising. So how does it actually work? Ah. Is it some crazy complicated algorithm? Well, according to, uh, well, the stuff you sent over. Yeah. They make it sound so simple, like four steps. Really? Yeah. Plug in your Google business profile info, uh -huh. and the software supposedly takes it from there, handles everything else to get those rankings. And everything else is a massive list of features. I mean, we're talking generating driving directions. Right. Building citations, keyword optimization. Yeah. Even high DR backlinks and YouTube embeds. So it's like they took everything. It's a Oh, Every yeah. trick in the book. Yeah, threw it in. Threw it all in, yeah. And it's interesting, they're focusing on driving directions. Yeah. Like, you don't normally think of that as like a big SEO thing, but I mean, it makes sense. Yeah, absolutely. People are searching for local businesses. Mm -hmm. They want to know how to get there. Especially yeah. especially on mobile, right? You're out and about. That's true. You need to know how to get there. And they are definitely hip to the visuals. Yeah. Which feels very now, you know? <laughs> for sure. They're talking about embedding... Google Maps mm -hmm. directly into your profile. Right. And even generating these like custom PDF reports. It's like anyone can have a Google business profile. Right. But does yours have a sleek little PDF? Exactly. And a custom map? It's about standing out. Yeah. In the crowd. Totally. Engagement. Right. Yeah. You got to stand out. Okay. But does it deliver? Right. Does GBP Dominator actually work? The testimonials? Yeah. They have some pretty bold claims. Oh. One user, Sterling Hall, said he saw crazy results in five days. Five days. I mean, come on. That's... That's suspicious. I want to believe that that is really fast. Yeah. And, and we have others like Katerina. She said good things. Okay. And an agency owner, David Thornton. Mm -hmm. But a lot of this is shared on, like, Facebook. Makes sense. Like yeah. social proof. Yeah. Seeing real people say they love a product. Yeah. Especially like in a casual place like Facebook. Right, but is it the full picture? Yeah, or are these just the, you know, yeah. the best of the best cases? Cherry pick. And here's where it gets even more interesting. They claim the benefits of GBP Dominator go beyond just Google rankings. Okay. They say it can boost the rankings of your other websites too, your money sites. So you're not just dominating local search, right. you're boosting your whole online presence. That's a big claim. <laughs> At least that's what they're saying. For sure, for sure. But speaking of impact, yeah. There's this whole section in here on retaining paying clients. Oh, okay. That is raising some eyebrows, let me right. tell you. How so? It's a very, let's say, unique approach. Okay. Basically, they're suggesting that once a client stops using GDP Dominator, right. you replace their links and maps 
with a competitor. Oh, so you're swapping them out. Yeah, someone who's paying wants that three-pack spot. Wow. So it's like a revolving door. It's wild, right. Of local SEO dominance yeah. powered by the software. You're basically saying to this business, hey, you get the boost. Right. But you stop paying, you lose your spot. Right. And, and they know that going in. Right, right. So is it really like is it really a level playing field at that point? Yes. Because it's like this software is manipulating the rankings. Yeah, it's a shortcut. Yeah. It's like a shortcut, right? And it's constantly speaking of like yeah. shifting landscapes. Right. You mentioned high DR backlinks. Mm. Can you for folks who don't, you know, eat and breathe this stuff? Sure. Can you explain why those are such a big deal? Yeah. So imagine imagine you're Google. They're okay. trying to rank a gazillion websites. That's a lot. Backlinks, they're like votes of confidence from other sites. Okay. So a high DR backlink, that's like a vote from like a celebrity. Someone important. Yeah. Someone Google already trusts. Okay. Carries a lot of weight. And they're claiming to provide a ton of these. Yeah. Over 50 from sites with like a domain rating of 90 or higher. 90 plus. Like that's. That's a lot. A lot of votes. GBP Dominator at least seems to get that. You get it. With the maps, with the PDFs, like... Visuals are huge. You gotta stand out. They are so important. Especially now, right? Especially now. Okay, so where does that leave us? Good question. With GBP Dominator. Yeah. We talked about features, we talked about their claims, right. potential drawbacks, like, what's the takeaway here? I think the takeaway is GBP Dominator. It's a tool. Okay. And like, any tool, you can use it well, you can use it poorly. Right. It might be powerful, it might not. It's tempting to think there's that, like, easy button. So it's less about outsmarting Google and more about, like... Working with them. Working with it. Yeah. Understanding how it operates. Think of it this way. Google wants to give searchers the best results. Okay. The most relevant, high-quality stuff. Right. So your goal is to become one of those results. To stand out. Yeah, to be the obvious choice. It's about building something real. Exactly. And that takes time and effort. Yeah. Got to understand your audience, right, you your industry. Create great content. Build relationships. Yeah. It's the whole package. It's everything. GBP Dominator can be part of that. The driving force should be you. It all comes back to authenticity. So as we wrap up this deep dive, okay. what's the final thought? What should folks be thinking about when it comes to this stuff? Building a strong online presence. It's a marathon, not a sprint. There's no shortcuts. No shortcuts. No magic buttons. But... If you focus on being authentic, yeah. providing value, connecting with your audience. You can build something that lasts. Something real. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. Okay, so what you saw there took literally 10 minutes of my time. And this is what I did. I went to Notebook LM, put in the URL. Like before, I used these suggested questions. I clicked on three of those and saved them as notes. And that helps prompt that Notebook LM to the desired questions in the interview. Then I copied that. I downloaded the WAV file, copied it, just dragged it into Camtasia and did a few edits, reduced it down from nine minutes down to six. And then I uploaded that audio, I saved it as a video file, uploaded it to YouTube so I could get the transcript. I copied that transcript into Pictory AI, and you can see it here. Pictory AI is easy, script to video, copy and paste the transcript into here, remove the timestamps, then save that file, put it back into Camtasia, added the video to the audio. As you can see here, adjusted the clip speed so they were both the same duration and boom, that's what you got. Five minutes of my time, and it produced that spectacular result. GBP Dominator, along with the Embedinator software that comes that comes with it, so you're buying two softwares for one, was already crushing in the market, and now it's going to be dramatically improved with premium AI content based on the exact business you're promoting, and also the location that you are promoting. Each of the driving directions going to your Google business profile has unique premium content based on that location going from there to there, which is location relevant, telling the people in that location why this is the best product for you in this exact location, and this location, and this location, and this location, and this location, unique content posted each time. The best news about this update is that our existing GBP dominators get this update for free. We are releasing it next week. All you need to do is restart your software. You'll be prompted with a download. Download it, install it, boom, you've got it. And it will be available to everyone else who would like to be able to have the same ability to post 
those before and after grids social, as social proof next week. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.